A sniper champion was something we knew we wanted to do for a long time, so once it got the green light, it was an easy call. Kinesa is our long range, high damage dealing new sniper champion for Paladins. Once we know we want to do a character, then it's the designer's job to come up with a kit. Uh, the kit is then passed around for review, make sure it's fun, rewarding, um, and then it goes through lots and lots of testing and iteration. Kinesa's kit has gone through, I think every one of her abilities has changed at this point. It's, it's interesting to see how her playstyle has evolved from that. There's a huge process of just all of the small details, like getting all the animations to work, all the effects set up. It's the whole design team's responsibility, but a lot of it weighs on the initial concept of the character. Um, who are they? What do they do? What do they look like? And then our, our very talented artists or their interpretation of what is it going to physically look like in the world of Paladins. The overall look and feel of her just feels pretty cool and just a little more badass than the other characters, I guess. <laughs> we definitely like went back and forth with a lot of different looks and stuff for her. One of the cool things about her was just like having like a big bulky kind of outfit. It was like different than like a other characters that had much more streamlined outfits. Having all the departments work, the, the animation, the VFX, having it all line up and kind of just like culminate um, in a, something that feels just awesome and fun to play. To get it ready for like 3D development, we just kind of want to try to make a clean, easy to read concept and have like clearer material definitions of like all the different parts of her outfit. Um, so what I would go through and do is like create like little material guides and stuff like this that allow you to see easily like what materials that should be and stuff. I worked on uh, sniper mode um, and I really enjoyed that because it was you have this transition time into sniper mode and transition time out so there's this system that I worked out with uh, making it mechanically work and with animations where you can uh, just unscope at any time, scope back, and it blends the animations properly, and you can rescope and back and forth, and it's just, it's real cool. The real meat and potatoes of it happens during playtesting. Um, whether or not it's exciting, whether or not the visuals match the play style, matches just rewarding in-game occurrences, um, and having it all linked together to just feel like a resounding, complete character.